Hello, hello once again. Thank you for tuning in. And if it's your first time here, my name is Chandra and I hope this message blesses you or somebody out there. And today's topic is the difference between prophetess and witches. My father wants me to come here and talk about the difference between prophetess and witches because these are the two types of mediums on earth. Both prophetess and witches are mediums on earth and a prophetess is a medium between heaven and earth. They speak the mind of God. They are the mouthpiece of God. But the witches, they are the mediums of Satan. They see and hear from Satan and work through familiar spirits which are mediums on earth for the enemy. Prophetess are supposed to cover their homes in prayers, while witches, they cast out spells, make mockery of their own homes, and expose their homes to demonic activities. So let's look at the book of Matthew 12, 29. It says, how can one enter a strong man's house and plunder his goods, unless he binds the strong man, and then he will plunder, plunder his house. This is the same principle principle that is used in deliverance to bind the strong man and use which is used the same principle to destroy a man and his household. And what they will do, they will start with the head of the house, which is the husband, and witches will get that man not to cover his wife in prayers. They will seduce him because the assignment is to tame his appetite and eventually destroy him and his household. And whenever you bring the head under control, you start to control everybody. Demons likes to go after people in authority and you can tell the level of a witch by the person they are after. Demons know that if they could get this person under the control, they will control people. They will pervert him and make him not to provide what's required of him, the will of God for his life, but he will submit to them. Enemy destroys a man by using witches as women. First, he will bring you welfare, and if both parties, husband and wife, are not praying, and they're not casting demons out of each other, he will bottle one, which is men, mostly men, with pride. He would want him not to admit his wrong, and that way, he will start being angry all the time. And one day, he will try and find a witch to take attention from his wife. He will go after that forbidden fruit. Then one day he will, he will start going there. One day he will sober up, realize this is not real love in fluctuation. He will then leave, then go for another witch who will come along, a higher ranking witch. The same vicious cycle will keep happening over and over. And this man is not aware that every female that he meets takes him up ranking. As he keeps on ascending to the upper ranking, which the witch that he will end up being with will finally destroy his home, bound him under his spell and finish the work. Now the man because he's under the spell, he'll start to despise his wife, disrespect his wife, build a case against his wife, and he will start to see everything wrong in everything that she does. So now the house is no longer covered in prayers and demons are everywhere. Demons are on the children, on him, on his wife, but the demons that he's been collecting from all these women. So that's why you have to be mindful of who you marry. So in the book of Leviticus 19.31, it tells us, do not turn to mediums or seek 
our spiritualist, for you all be defiled by them. I am the Lord your God. And the same book of Leviticus, Leviticus 20.62, it says, I will set my face against anyone who turns to mediums and spirits to prostitute themselves by following them and I will cut them off from the people. A man or a woman who is a medium or spiritualist among you must be put to death. You are the, you have to stone them. The blood will be on their own hands. So what my father is trying to explain here, he's trying to explain that mediums are not from him. We have to differentiate the difference between witches and prophetess because both of these people are mediums, but they don't minister to the same God. Some minister to God, our Father, and some the minister to their own gods, which is the enemy, Satan on earth. We have to be aware of these two mediums and we have to pay our attention on God alone. Seek him because all the answers, we can get them from him. We don't need to go seek the answers from mediums, from spiritualists. We need to get everything from our Father via reading his word. Seek him and meditate on his word and he will speak to us. So I hope now you know the difference between these two mediums, the prophetess and the witches, the mediums of Satan and the mediums of God, our Father, our Lord, our Father in heaven, Jesus Christ. So I hope you've been blessed by this message. And if you have, please like and share and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and God bless you.